hello everyone today i will show you how to install a printer driver for a konica minolta c2279 so for that uh, we will do from chrome so first of all we will open the chrome browser here it is then let it start here we have to search download center for konica minolta uh, download center center CNTR for konica minolta so in that we will get all the drivers for konica simply we will click ok and uh, go to drivers and download first link drivers and download after that uh, here product has came um, here we will search our product c227i which we are having whatever you having you just put the your uh, model num name here that's all and then we will check which system we are which operating system we are using in this case we are using windows 11 so we need to specify the windows uh, which operating system we are using here windows 11 pro so simply we will search the product go and uh, then here choose operating system will come here we will select windows 11 11 yes here it is windows 11 and now hit the ok button then it will come universal driver so first link we will click and here we will download pcl6 pcl6 and accept the agreement zip file we need to download just single click on zip file it will start downloading once download is complete it will be in zip file we need to unzip that folder then only we can install so here it is downloading is done now we will open that folder yes it is done open that folder then here we will click right click on the that same folder right click press right right click and extract all option will come here we will do extract all if you want you select any c drive or anything just simply extract it here you can browse also extract once it is done then we will got get the file for uh, all type of windows so simply we need to click on that uh, setup 64 setup 64 so we will click on setup 64 and uh, simply just we need to do next 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 once that pop-up will come here we will agree it and we will do for manual install network search here we will check if it is connected with the same network then only network search it will come that printer name so we will yes here it is came we just simply tick that first option konica minolta bins of c226i and the click on next next install let it be finished once it is done the printer will be installed after that you can easily use if we, if you are not in same network that printer will not show so you just check that network should be same then only that printer will come uh, let it be done yes it is done now click ok now we can check while going that uh, setting search for printer and we will check uh, is our uh, printer is installed or not here it is here upd here it is installed and uh, if you want you can give what is page also because it is already installed once here it is showing idle it means it is installed successfully so like this you can install and uh, make sure that printing preference will be a4 or uh, sometimes what happened it is selected as uh, 8 and half into 11 or uh, later size so you just check second option uh, first original size will be a4 then next same as the original now it is done uh, now we will check for second method also we have a second method also how we can install so simply we will search for printer and uh, here it will came so simply we will click on add device 
add device once you click on the add device it will take some time it will search printer if it is not coming you go to add new device manually here you have to click tcp ip next here also you have to select tcp ip tcp ip device then here you have to put the printer ip in my case it is 192.168.29.231 so you can check also what is your printer ip it is producing so so once you put the ip then click on simply click on next uh, here it is done we will click on next and uh, we need to give a path driver path we will click next a driver path you have to copy from where you just we just downloaded one driver no? from there we need to copy that uh, path and uh, we just click have a disk and we will go where we downloaded that uh, driver here it is driver section we will go last option here we have to select 64 64 64 and then we have to copy that path simply we will put that path on that uh, setting menu so that it will detect our printer and simply we will click on next here we have to put the or you can browse also so once it is done you just select first option and click next then again next so it is asking just because uh, right now we installed one driver and another driver is coming that is why it is asking so no need to take anything you just simply click on next and here next and finish here it is done so here also that printer is installed uh, yes it is installed and uh, now one more option we have if you don't have any network connection you want to connect with the usb then that option also we have we simply open that driver what we downloaded in starting and uh, simply open it and we will click on setup 64 in that case we have to select manual setting because in network it is not there connected na? so we will select manual and whatever the you connected usb na? here we will click agree and select manual setting manual setting we need to network if you have a network otherwise we will select manual if you are using usb then here we have to add a printer then add to list then we will select port setting here port setting if you are having multiple usbs then it will show usb 1 2 3 in my case only one usb is there so it is one showing just simply click on that and click ok then hit next button and here we can install so once it completed then we can easily use our printer in my case so uh, in last option we are using scan to uh, sorry print to usb but most of the people's having network only so better is install on network so that also it is done and here we will we will go and check whether it is installed or not it is done now we will check just simply click on print test page and we will check whether our driver is successfully installed or not here our printer we given a test page let's see yes it is coming it is showing in job list so yes it came yes okay thank you for watching